This video is intended to show the correct method used to assemble Pilot Rock GB Series Gibraltar benches. A 6 foot model is used to demonstrate assemblies with center frames. A 4 foot bench requires only 2 frames. If these directions are followed closely, the bench will assemble easily and stand square and solid. Tools required for assembly are a ratchet and half inch socket and a large flat screwdriver. Try to find a firm, level surface to assemble the bench on. If one is not available, a sheet of plywood can help level out rough ground surfaces. Now let's get acquainted with the parts of the bench. There are two, three, or four cast iron bench frames for four foot, six foot, or eight foot benches, respectively. Notice the mounting flange with the oversized 5 16 inch bolt holes that are positioned on alternating sides of each frame. Now notice that the seven recycled plastic slats have slotted holes drilled 3 and 3 quarter inches from one end and 1 and 3 quarters inches from the other end. During assembly, the end of the slat with the hole 3 and 3 quarter inches from the end will pass through the frame to align the hole in the slat with the hole in the mounting flange towards the center of the bench. The other end of the slat with the hole 1 and 3 quarter inches from the end will pass through the other end frame to align with the hole in the mounting flange towards the outside of the bench. The hole locations alternate from slat to slat. The included fastener kit contains seven 5 16 by 2 and 1 quarter inch long slotted head bolts, seven 5 16 inch hex nuts, and seven 3 8 inch flat washers for each bench frame. A very important step in the procedure is to place one 3 8 inch flat washer as a spacer between the slat and the frame on all bolt connections. The plastic slats will warp if these washers are not properly installed on every connection. Standing behind the bench, begin by standing the frame in the end position on your right in the upright position. Slide the end of a slat with the hole 3 and 3 quarter inches from the end through the top opening in the frame. Insert a 5 16 by 2 and 1 quarter inch bolt through the recycled plastic slat. Slide a 3 8 flat washer between the slat and the bench frame, aligning it with the hole, and continue pushing the bolt through the hole in the mounting flange on the bench frame. Placing the flat washer between the slat and the frame mounting flange as a spacer is very important for proper alignment of the bench. Turn a 5 16 inch nut onto the bolt, leaving it loose. Do not tighten any bolts until the entire bench is assembled. Again, using the end of a slat with the hole 3 and 3 quarter inches from the end, repeat the process for the front slat. Again, be sure to insert a flat washer between the slat and the frame. If the bench requires center frames, slide the top slat through the respective opening of the frame and move the frame to the center of the length of the slat. Slide the end frame onto the end of the slat and install top bolt, flat washer, and nut. Lift the front slat and slide it into place on the frame. Bolt the front slat to the frame. Now the bench is loosely assembled enough to secure any center frames using the same process used on the end frames. Once these slats are loosely attached to the frames, the remaining slats can be slid through each frame. Be sure to alternate the hole positions of the slats to align with the holes in the frames. 
Install the remaining bolts, inserting a flat washer spacer on every connection and loosely thread nuts onto all of the bolts. All of the parts should now be in place. Starting at one end of the bench, square the frame and slats and tighten the top, front and one center bolt on that frame enough to hold the frame firmly in place. Square and snug the other end of the bench. Square and snug any center frames. Align the ends of the slats. Recheck frames for being square. Make any adjustments needed until the frames are square and the ends of the slats are aligned. Then tighten all of the bolts. The bench should now be fully assembled and properly aligned to provide years of satisfying service.